welcome back to another episode of Falcoria. I uh, haven't long finished uh, from finish the other one. I've uh, been making, finding some more flowers and I actually noticed a couple more beehives around the area. So I'm just sort of like working out because I've, I've hung around this area for a little bit and I've come across probably close to half a dozen beehives. The one thing I'm interested in is the actual ratio of how many beehives there are to certain biomes because I'm formulating the idea because of the actual terrain generation of there being so many flowers and like for this biome being a, intended for that whether the possibility of finding beehives is a higher chance than it is for other biomes such as the flower does the forest by the forest, forest biome so it'll be interesting to say to I'm actually not going to let these little bony basses get me okay I did spy a another hive somewhere close by. I'm just trying to see it because I'd, I'd seen it from a distance. Uh, so I'm actually thinking with some of these beehives, I'm probably going to... It's a possibility of looking at selling them as part of merchandise for my bee shop. But just gonna sort of like see what happens because I think it might be a good idea. But then I've got to see if it's actual possible supply. So what south? So it's actually south is ocean. Let's go down here and that's birch forest. Oh well, what do you know? And shit, I do actually need to get my silk pick. You fucker ain't gonna get my make me die. Okay. So I think that's sort of like pr I think that's kind of proving the fact that it's like that there looks to be a higher concentration of beehives in this area than other biomes. I'll probably continue to do more exploring, but I didn't actually realise that they spawned on no but birch trees as well. Um, let's have a look. There's horses over there. And did I? No, I didn't. It was just flowers. So I might sort of 50-50. Oh, yes, there's another beehive. And I've got space. Come on, Black Reaper. Take him out. What quite possibly one of the most powerful swords in the game for myself. Not including the fact I don't actually have the netherite upgrade yet. It's I'm not really don't probably not gonna go too far further south. Oof. I'm getting warped by the Well, one thing I'd like to do is possibly get horses onto my island. Don't know if I'm going to be able to... Oh. Let's see. Let's have a look just a bit further. We'll look over here. Because I'm going to... Add some more bees to my collection. Uh, let's see. It's I'll go in circles. Just seeing what there is on right here. <clears throat> let's see. That's. Okay, 
I got plenty of those. If I come across any ocean bio, any coral biomes, or dev, be sure to explore those. Hello, baby drowned. So I'm actually kind of surprised that this will be episode 43. It's been running quite a while and I still haven't haven't uh, far from finished base yet. I've still got plans of uh, recording bosses I'm facing, building up my base area. Just try and make it make it as good as I can. Uh, some yeah, the water ravine. Yeah, this would be a good place to die. Okay, there we go. Let's sleep through at night. Okay, let's drop in a new residence. So I did kill a bee. In the last uh, off camera, however, I do justify that it. it was not one of my one of these guys. It was actually a wild hive. So I do. Just so I would get that. Oh yes, beautiful. So that's instantly instantaneous. So I've got to I've got to figure out. I'm probably gonna up, need to upgrade the B area, B place, much better because I'm not happy with this. The way this design is going, it's just not reliable enough. I need to extend this further out so that the ten hives are separated. The redstone is separated. And possibly add in some, like, just replace those hives, possibly. I'm not sure. I'm going to pop these chests down. I'm going to grab a whole bunch of materials and uh, work at a plan. Uh, so obviously that means this is going to have to be upgraded. But that's not a problem. It's just going to be something that I'll, I'll have, I'd continue off camera. So I've got this. I'll get some... Oh, where is that? Polished basalt. So I do need to get some... So the Basalt is nice, but I'm doesn't. I'll go up here. It doesn't really. It does, but it doesn't fit. Well, it does closer fit in, but I've got to. So I'm just gonna work out. So that. I need more redstone. Obviously, I'm gonna make some more of the rails. So when it does hit night time, I've got to take out those beehives. Okay, so I've got... Grab some... Is it... Grass blocks? Probably do at least a couple of stacks. A nether chest. We'll look. I'll go for... At least that... Yeah, so I get some glass. Okay, music discs. 
Cross chests, uh, redstone materials. Right at. I wonder, can I pass possibly hook up the uh, the bells? Maybe that would be interesting to have the bells hooked up as a system to tell me when it's done. Uh, okay, I need to grab iron. Okay, that. Okay, then so you know, a whole bunch of materials, and when it comes to night time, I'm gonna change it up. Oh, I need to. Uh, I'll dump that in there. Assets. Let's take these out. Okay, that does, as a matter of fact, go for it, so. Uh, night time it'll have to be so I can make the arrangements. Cow okay, a chest. Cause you'll see I've actually got quite a bit of honey now. So it's what's that? So all those hives are going to be full. Let's actually have a look at how many hives I did actually get. So one of these hives is empty, but the other ones aren't. Including those two that I just plopped in there. That's actually pretty reasonable, so... Let's uh, start... Oops, shivers. Don't want that to happen just yet. However, what I can do is take these back bits off. <coughs> I work out because I've got now that I've got a rough idea of how the bees area should look, I've got to focus, then focus on obtaining, making it um, reasonable. So I've got an idea, I'm going to have to trial on, try and build up, maybe like a circle to make it actually look like a hive roughly. I'll do as in is just in case. Because if that's ten hives, so. So it's. So it still needs to be space, so then you'd save that block. Huh, okay, so possibility of maybe a circuit run running underneath, but I'd have to, hmm, so it's, 
So, if following that idea, I could actually do two separate ones. So, that would still keep that somehow. Let's. Okay. So, mark of a leaf is a bee nest. With this at I wonder, is it? Yeah, there would be dispensers behind these, but okay. So doing a rectangular design could work. So in the very least, that would have to be done. So then, bam, bam, bam. That, bam, bam, bam. So the idea is to have some sort of redstone underneath as well at the same time. So, that. Bam, bam, bam. No, bam. Uh, I'm gonna check the timer as well because I'm actually getting a bit of an idea of what I want. So I'm gonna use this as a testing tester platform. So if I say uh, this is the middle. That, 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 no, that would not work, sorry. Oops. Oh, there was actual stone there. And, so there's a bit of... Okay, let's get the plan into action. Right, this is ticking to Time is ticking. I need to get, drop those, 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 and those. I'm not losing in any more hives. Okay, there we go. Very that. Because we've got to work out the rail system is the one, is the part that's going to be tricky to do. That's the one I bit, I am a little bit worried about. Ah, uh, crap, all the, um. Let's do this. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, that would make two double double chest. Okay. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish off this episode and I'm going to time, I'm going to do a time lapse of it. And uh, by the day, for the next episode, I'll uh, see you after the time lapse in the next episode. Adios.